I noticed this a few days ago. This rhubarb right here is going into flower and I don't want that. You can see that the other ones are not going to flower. Kind of a weird way for me to stand with the lights right now. But anyways, especially young rhubarb like this, I just planted these this year. So we don't want it to go to flower and I want to get rid of these before it does anything else. Literally just get rid of all these flowers. There's a bunch. And the way that you do that is you basically just get as close to the ground as you can and twist and pull those stems out. Because we want all of this rhubarb to be putting its energy into the root system. And I probably could have waited a little bit longer to do this. Trying to get as close to the ground as I can and get all of those seed heads out. Of course, you're going to have to put up with my cat's butt. Because he's over here trying to... That's probably about as good as I can get that one. Anyways, I'll probably have to check out again in another week or so because... Once they generally start to go into flower, they'll try to do it several times. But I'll come back and keep an eye on this. I check on them every couple of days. And uh, we just want it to be producing stalks and not flowers at this stage. Um, when they're several years old, you can let them flower. But usually the first year or two, I don't let them flower at all. Um, and that will actually help, you know, the stalks to grow more and to get larger and that sort of thing but um so because i have bees though in a few years i would be okay with them going to flower you know not all at once because i got four plants but you know if one wants to go to flower in say two or three more years that would be fine but i wouldn't let all of them go to flower and then uh anyways i just wanted to show you this since it was happening if you run into that on new rhubarb that's probably less than two or three years old, don't let them go to flower. Get rid of the flower heads. Thanks for watching. As always, God bless you. God bless your families. God bless your homesteads. And excuse the cattail in the uh, video. <laughs> Thanks for watching.